Hello today, and today we're going to have a game of Arctic Moves on the PC MS DOS, and this is a game request by Amstrado to do El Dia on YouTube. Right, so this is the I think the third game in the moves games. We had um, army moves, navy moves, which I have reviewed on the Amstrad CPC. And now we got Arctic moves on the DOS. Never come out. I don't think this come out on any um, um, 8 bit system. I don't know what else it came out on actually. Um, all I know, I was told about it, it was it came out on the PC. Um, never played it, of course. It's in Spanish only. That's going to be a problem. Um, yeah, big problem. But. There is another problem that I can't sort out. There's no sounds. I can't get the sounds working, so we're gonna have to play this in silence. It's not like it matters anyway, because I cannot understand Spanish. So, it probably won't be a very good review, but there's not a lot I can do about that. Yeah, you could translate it. Oh yeah, I'm really gonna spend all my time translating it, and I? No, I'm fucking well not. Right, let's go to mission one. I'm taking that. Mission one. No point looking at the breathing. It's all in Spanish. Access code. Start info. What's the point of looking at the info? It's all in Spanish. So let's start. Oh, you can't use joystick. It's not configured. So I've got to use cursor keys. Space bar to shoot. And you know it's going to be a dynamic game. So what do you expect? Hardness. Hard. It's going to be hard as nails. Certainly got some nice animation going on here. But we can only imagine what it would sound like. I'm only assuming they're supposed to be sounds. I mean, it'd be pretty stupid if, you know, you're programming something on a PC. And I do believe this came out in 1995. So, PCs would have had advanced sounds by then. I think maybe the Sound Blaster 16, maybe. So we would have had sounds, no doubt about that. But I'm, I'm sure this version, you know, there's, there's something up with this version. I can't get it all run with sounds, which is a pity, but we can't have everything. And you get a timer ticking down there. So that resets your timer if you pick up those clocks. Don't know how you select weapons, but as I said, it's pointless. No point, because it's all in Spanish. Just a shame there wasn't, mind you, as I said, 1995. I think the 8-bit systems would have been over at that, that point. I mean, 1995, what was I on? I was on my Amiga. I was on 16-bit territory. Even 16-bit, but even 16-bit computers had by 95 were seeing the, the end of its time, seeing the end of its run. Where it would have you had the PlayStation out, um, PC was up and coming machine. All right, let's have a look at Mission Two. And start. Oh, I can't start it. So I've got to do mission one first. Yeah, about 95. There was not many games. I had an Amiga at that point, and there wasn't a lot of titles coming out at that point. We had some good titles like Worms. I mean, that was a. I think that was a 95 game for the Amiga. That was an absolutely amazing game. That was Worms. Obviously that also came out on the PC. But yeah, the 32, you had the PlayStation. Obviously this is DOS, I mean. It really depends when in 95 this came out. Was it pre-95? Might have been pre-95. So 
so we've had Windows 3.1 and things were probably running in DOS then anyway. No, yeah, but it's, it's, it's a pity there's no sound effects in this. I can only imagine that would have been pretty good. I am running this via a program called um, DOSBox. DOSBox is pretty good at emulating, um, well I say emulating, it is using the real, real, um, real programs there, so it's, I think you would say it is emulating, but, but it's actually running the real DOS programs. So it's good that we do have a DOS emulator. So you can, if you was a DOS person back in the day, you can relive all these old classic games. Oh, I'm out of weapon, no. I, ain't. I mean, it's all right. I mean, it's, I don't think, well, it's hard, but I think I'm making a molehill out of it. Ah, oh, fuck, so I'm gonna have to go up that, and I? Ah, and it's game over again. It is a pity there's no sounds, and there is, and it is a pity there's no English version. All right, okay. Well, we'll have one more go. Well, oh, Arctic moves. That's in English. Why can't the old fucking game be in English? All right, let's start. Try and concentrate a bit. I don't know, I don't know, to be honest, if this was an official game. Might well have been, but I don't know. Obviously this, as I said, didn't come out on the 8-bit systems. So that makes me think, if there was a DOS version, as I said, I don't know if it's an official game, could this have come out on the Amiga? Or the ST. And you know damn well there would have been no problem with sounds on that, on them systems. So I'm using cursor keys and the space bar as I said. I don't know if there's any additional buttons I can push. It's all the Spanish, there's no point reading instructions because it's all in Spanish. Ah, oh, fuck, I need to get up there, right. Is he going to get up there, or do I have to get on that box? I've done it lots of times, now I can't do it. Oh, here we go, we've got to get on the truck. That's what you got, and I'm fucking dead. Oh, got another life. How many lives do I get? Was that a four there? Raiders? Raiders? I don't know what that means. Oh, I need to get up there. That looks like that could be an extra life, maybe, or extra energy. Get out of the way, you stupid bastard. Right, that tops up your energy. Okay. Oh, we can go in, go in the buildings. Right, I need to go down, but how do I go down? I can't go down. Oh, I've got to go through the door, don't I? Oh, you push down, go through the door, okay. Right, so that'll give me, that gives me a bit of extra time. Some more time up there. Oh, ooh. so I need to get how do I get up there? Because I can't go. Can I jump the barricades? No, I can't. I die. So that ain't live. So it must be a way of getting. No, I can't jump the barricades. Nah. And I'm dead. Well, I think that's all we're going to see. I can't figure that bit out actually. Maybe I have to go up somewhere. 
Uh, would I come back to it? I don't know. Maybe. I maybe would have come back to it. Um, it does seem possible. It doesn't seem as difficult as army and navy moves. Um, so there's some playability about it. But I just wish I could sort the sounds out. But oh well, can't deal with it. And obviously the problem is it's Spanish only and I can't understand Spanish. So that's a major flaw personally for me because I only can speak English and I struggle with that. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to end this now. Thank you so much for watching. Till next time and goodbye.